WGN's Joel Hillary is here with the story. Joel. That's right, Michael. Well, tonight's meeting was definitely well attended. In fact, so many people showed up that there was over space, overflow space was needed. It's likely there could be at least two additional meetings before the Land Use Commission goes before the proposal for the City Council. Now, Northwestern University is proposing a new state of the art $800 million stadium to replace the current Ryan Field where the Northwestern Wildcats play. Representatives from the university spoke during tonight's meeting saying the new stadium would be built without any taxpayer dollars and provide huge economic relief for the area. Our new Ryan Field is an $800 million ticket to economic prosperity with 35% dedicated to local, minority and women owned businesses. That's $208 million that we plan to spend locally. While the new stadium would be privately funded, Northwestern says it would need to have six concerts at the stadium to help fund the project. That's an area of concern for many residents in the area. Several showing up tonight with posters saying no rezoning and no rezoning, no concerts, no compromise. We will not be seeing mega concerts like Taylor Swift or Metallica or Guns N' Roses. We all are mostly Evansonians, although we have a number of our, of our neighbors from Wilmette who also have joined us this evening. Um, but we all do live in this community together and we can have different opinions uh, without being um, antagonistic towards each other. University officials say the new stadium would have 12,000 fewer seats than the current stadium and be fully equipped to be accessible for everyone. Public transportation drop-off locations, uh, accessible par designated parking spaces. The design has 200% of the required accessible parking spaces allocated for this design. Now at last check, tonight's meeting was still in progress and there will likely be another meeting on September 27th to continue tonight's discussion. Mike and Ray, back to you.